Welcome to Mets Baseball Heaven 97. Let me in, let me in, let me in. 
Next up, a road trip to Melbourne to face teams from the Marlins Invitational Baseball Heaven for doubleheader action. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
You had a lot of fun today. Yeah, I know you did. I got up ten times, I walked seven of them, and I stood in center field for five hours while we walked 30 guys. But I had a great day. Baseball heaven. The gold rope is presented to a man who pitched an outstanding game, the first game of the doubleheader. Mark Maselli? Yeah. yeah. Mark pitched a seven inning complete game. He had eight strikeouts and no walks. Woo! He only threw 268 pitches. <laughs> <laughs> and he cannot lift his arms again. Outstanding job. Thank you. Great job. Boy, Mark. <laughs> now, there is an admission on here of every single thing that was done and trying to blame my good friend Pat Zachary. I so that, I think that's a pretty oh, good <laughs> along with <laughs> along uh, along with the brown rope. Fits too. Yeah. I think there needs to be a public apology. To not only the organization of the New York Mets, but to Pat Zachary as an individual. Right, I do apologize. You, Play ball. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's three. Yeah. Oh, three. Three.
All right. Good game. Good game. Way to battle. Way to battle. Good job. Come carry it. Give me some of this. Give me some of this. Good job. Not going to Disney World yet. Chick, you made that grass spin. David Lewis, <clears throat> Muscle Beach. If you left your shirt off today, it would have been better for the camera. Not, not two days In ago. the first game yesterday, David won five for five with three RBIs. 
In the second game, he went three for four with four RBIs, and he was the game-winning pitcher. He came in in relief, pitched three and two-thirds innings, and had six Ks. So on the day, he was <coughs> eight for nine with seven RBIs and a game-winning pitcher. Uh, we forgot to give the brown rope. I think just uh, this has kind of been a unanimous decision, one of the very few unanimous decisions we've had. But after the day that Bob Apodaca had, I think he deserves the brown rope. Bobby, come forward and get your award. What did this rope cost me? You want to appeal? No. Okay. <laughs> just an explanation. Do you have anything you'd like to say in front of all these pros? I worked right. very hard to get this. <laughs> I'm going to work twice as hard today to keep it. Get a boy. All right. All right, guys. Good effort, Freddie. They're all yours. Play ball. Play ball. Play ball. Somebody to run. 
seven ball games, we completed six. That's the only time I've taken a man out of a game, and we were three outs from having seven complete games. You did one hell of a job. That was a team effort. It was, uh, it was a good move on your part at the end. I know where to put you. you know? <laughs> it worked out for the best. Okay. Did you have a good week? I had a great week. Right. It's a great way to top it off. Right. That's a week. The Hackers' reward for winning the championship is being the first to face their former heroes in the games against the pros. Play ball. Who said take it easy? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Two.
There's a fly ball in the short left field for a base hit. And Dak is getting hit early here. Long fly ball to center field. He can't get to it. And Spear trots into second base with a stand-up double. And he strokes one down the left field line. Here we go. That's going to score a run. It's going to score a run. Let's see. And the catch is made in right field. on the field complete, it's time for the awards banquet. The Tom Seaver Award for the week's top pitcher goes to Rob Wolf. The Bud Harrelson Award for the week's best fielder is grabbed by Joe Cardesco. Dave Lewis garners the week's top hitter award. The Bob Euchre Personality Award is presented to Fred Schwartz. The RBI Leader Award goes to Chris Morrow. And the Big Game Award goes to Ralph Hazelbaker. And, uh, we give a Big Game Award, and the trophy is in the mail or en route somewhere, as with the other ones. But today, uh, for one of the first times, uh, we had a team that scored on us. And even probably more so than that, uh, we had someone who had two hits against us. Um, so... We are going to give our big game award today to Mr. Ralph Hazelbaker. Yeah. With two hits against the pros. Yeah. Ralph's not here. I was just kidding. The real award goes to... <laughs> Who's here? <laughs> nice going, Ralph. You hemorrhoid. I just got on it. That's it for 1997. We look forward to seeing you again in 1998 at Baseball Heaven. I could honestly say that I didn't really learn much about baseball being on Doug's team. However, one thing I did learn a lot about was life. Bases loaded, two out, a really stressful situation. I'd say, Doug, how long have you been married? And Doug would tell me the whole story and everything else. Um, I have been distracted, and i got to tell you a little bit why. When I first came to camp, I just came here to play ball. Baseball heaven. David Seltzer said it the best, baseball is heaven. And then I got to thinking about all the guys whose wives brought, bought them presents for their 40th birthday and how nice that sounded. And a couple of times when I came home really late at night, sore as hell, and I saw my girlfriend there rubbing mineral lice all over my body, and I mean all over my body. <laughs> I got to thinking, you know, maybe it's time I settled down. Now, having had no hits at all two years ago at fantasy camp, sort of as a goof and sort of seriously, I said, if I get eight hits, <laughs> me, eight hits, <laughs> I will settle down. And of course, my girl, where? Nicole, come here for a second. <laughs> 
translation. Felix, of course, helped translate. Because Nicole is from Colombia. She doesn't know much about the game of baseball and how much I love the game of baseball. But any event, I am a man of my word. And all I could say is, I didn't have this planned at all. I feel a little stupid because I don't have a ring or anything else. But are you translating? Brad, <laughs> 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 you want to help him? Let's get that. Baseball may be happy. You have made my life paradise. I love you very, very much. Will you marry me? Here is the ball. <laughs> I owe you a ring. <laughs> I love it. Uh -oh. Let me make sure that's right. Is you saying yes to you or, or to, to, to him or Felix? Let me make sure. Yeah, okay. no. How about a big congratulations to these two? Yes. Yeah.